anyways, getting into it. Today we're going to be doing, um, we're going to be playing Phasmophobia. We're going to be doing it by, by myself. Contained within Phasmophobia lies the unknown, the mysterious, and all that's paranormal. For those uninitiated in the ways of Phasmophobia, it's a game where typically you and three other brave souls venture into haunted locations, working together to uncover clues and confront spirits within. But tonight, we're throwing caution aside as I embark on a solo paranormal journey. And there's a twist. Each time I enter, my loadout will be randomized, so I might not even start with a trusty flashlight. So settle in, fasten your seatbelts, and prepare yourselves for a solo paranormal investigation like no other. And remember, what you're about to witness might not be for the faint of heart. Viewer discretion is strongly advised. So they really update they really updated this game from when I like when I last when I last played, so Yeah, this was this didn't used to be like this. Oh. It's odd. So, over here we choose a contract. I feel like going in theme with, uh, with today's plan, we're gonna go random for our first one. Um, and we're gonna hope that we don't get Lake Prison or Sunny Meadows. Our first investigation was a bit of a wash. The items didn't randomize properly and the ghost hunted us almost immediately. Afterward, we decided to set up a wheel spinner to help with the randomization process and give it another go. This is that investigation. So, we'll do f five spins, including duplicates, because if I get like, if I get like two EMF readers, that's not gonna help me very much, right? I, I think we're, we're in agreement on that. All right, let's go. First one, let it spin for dramatic effect. Uh, fuck yes, okay. Top tier, let's go. We're getting, <laughs> I, <laughs> Hope I can play that sound effect. Uh, we got a flashlight. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Wait, can I bring a tripod? I don't think I have tripods unlocked. Or maybe it comes with- yeah, I don't think I have it unlocked. Okay, video camera. <laughs> okay. okay. Just in case I lose the first one. <laughs> not bad, not bad. UV light. And last one. Our number five will be... Okay! <laughs> so, to recap... I can bring two flashlights, a video camera, and two UV lights. Great! If you've never played Phasmophobia before, this is a very bad loadout. First of all, the entire point of the game is to collect different types of evidence to determine what kind of ghost it is. That is going to be significantly harder if I only have two flashlights, two glow sticks, and a video camera. However, different ghosts do different things. For example, the poltergeist is more likely to move objects around the room, while a demon has a way higher chance to hunt. So I'm going to have to pay extremely close attention to determine what kind of ghost I am dealing with. And as you'll see in our first investigation, this limited loadout is going to make things incredibly challenging. Alright, amateur, intermediate, professional. Never mind, we're doing professional. Because that's what I am. Wait, what? What do you mean equipment list? That's... Equipment not added. Equipment you've added. Well, that means I haven't added any equipment. What? How do I add equipment? <laughs> oh. Do I need to... Ah, there we go. 
but I didn't have the video camera. Why? Do I have a video camera? Oh, I need to... This setup is so confusing. Oh, and now I need to add, add it. Okay, there we go. <sighs> now... Equipment... That's equipment that I've added. Okay. We're doing random, professional. There we go. That... <laughs> what do you... <laughs> Why do I have this? This... Yes. Why do I have that equipment? That's not how that should work. <laughs> Welcome back. Am I just stupid? How do I... Would I add... Cheat? I'm, I'm trying. Alright. Okay. I guess... I'm too stupid to figure out how to, how to use this, so... We will... Random, ready up. We'll figure it out from here. This time we're going to Grafton. Grafton Farmhouse. So I can get two UV light. Okay. This game confuses me. Here's what I'll do I'll take. All the stuff I can use, and I'll toss it off right here. Uh, so whoever summoned it, summoned it with a cursed item. That's good to know. Uh, Ava Dyer? Eva? Ava? Oh, those are per- those aren't, like, per mission now. Okay, that's good to know. I can see my sanity. Let's go. Oh, freaking great. Hello. Are you... Do I need to... Guys, I heard a door already. I haven't even opened the the, the place yet, and I heard a door. <laughs> I'm. St I don't want to. Okay. Um. Well, right off the bat, I'm gonna turn on the lights. The lights aren't on. Awesome. Are you the break? Are you not the breaker? I thought this would be. This is the breaker, but I guess not. I need to find the breaker to turn the power. On. Oh, breaker! I think was in here. No. Awesome. We got some lights, so... Apparently, the ghost was summoned by a... That was a door. What door was it? You guys heard that. That was a door. Was that one of these doors? No. So it was summoned by a, by a cursed object, so I want to try to find that. That might give me my best chance of figuring out what it is. Ah! <laughs> I, I turned on my mic for that, I, I hope you know, so that was my first interaction with the ghost. Is anybody here? This game is fucking terrible. 
terrifying by yourself. You guys have no idea. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Is that true? I, last time I, last time it didn't look like that was true. Pretty sure it was. Okay, maybe it's like in my options. Voice recogni recognition mode. What the fuck? I heard a- what the fuck? I heard a laugh. What the fuck? I heard a laugh. I've never heard a laugh before. What the fuck? I've heard a laugh. <laughs> I don't like that. It sounded like it came from over here. Is that- Is that the cursed object? Or is that just a regular bear? I think it's just a regular bear. <sighs> That's weird, the lights are like cutting through the the ground. I I know there's Ouija board and like there's like a puppet. Oh, it was a voodoo doll, wasn't it? sign where are you oh, that's just the lights freaking out I can turn on the lights up here so it's hello hearing distant noises. It said to listen for distant noises. I'm hearing distant noises. always here, right? I, I, yeah, that was always there. That, sorry, I'm getting paranoid. I, I don't know what they added it didn't add to this game. So we took a bit of a look around. I would. I <coughs> Sorry, I'm not quite sure where the cursed item is. Uh, I'm gonna turn that on for safety. Keep repeating its name. I'm scared too. <laughs> but okay, I, if I must, um, let me. Do you get? How do you rotate it? Ava, can you give me a sign? 
Ava? Oh, I heard that. Is that in here? Ava? Hello? I don't like this hum. Ava? Or I'm getting the hell out of here. <laughs> oh god. Freaking hate that. Hate that so much. At 42 sanity. Um Here's our grainy house camera. I don't know what to do here. Um, it's okay. So I haven't gotten like any. Um, ultraviolet things, fingerprints. So I'm just gonna cross that off for now, but I'm not officially ruling it out, just for, like, sake of guessing right now. Crossing off ultraviolet. Um, I have a camera set up. What can I even check for with that? Ghost orbs? Okay. I'm not, I'm not seeing any orbs. Orbeez. Um, I can't even take sanity pills. Okay. Are there other cameras? No, it's just the one outside. I'm not seeing it. Do, do, do you guys know, like, have any idea where it came from? I, I'm not quite sure. Let's mm -hmm. head back in for any ideas. I'm gonna move the camera as well. Let's do a quick walk around, look for orbs with this. see breath. I know they changed freezing temps so that you don't. You see your breath even if it's at zero or like close to it. So it could not, it, it could, there's a potential, potential that it's not freezing temperatures. Hey, thank you for watching. I'm recording this about like 20 minutes before it, the video actually goes live. Um, and I've been trying so hard to get a good ending sequence for this video. 
but nothing, no matter what I do, I cannot get a good script down, and I cannot, <laughs> I cannot get my mouth to word properly enough for it to, like, seem cohesive enough. So I'm just saying, screw it, throw out the script, here I am, it's just me. <laughs> if you... <laughs> If you like the video, uh, please give it a thumbs up and, and subscribe, it really helps me out. And, um, I am likely live streaming on Twitch right now, or if not right now, then very soon. Uh, we're going to be playing through Omori for the first time. Uh, my first time, that is. I, I know nothing about it, I just, <laughs> so many people have told me to play it, and now I feel like my debt has sort of run out, and I sort of have to. <laughs> um, I hear it's really good, though. But anyways, if you liked this video, uh, tell your friends, tell your family, tell your goldfish about this YouTube channel, and uh, expect a lot more out of me in the coming few months. Thank you. Bye.